It seems one crisis leads to another. Aside from COVID and the economy, there's also the challenge of child care. Natalie says, I had just launched a new business in February, and due to the COVID situation, I had to pause everything. My kids have not been allowed to attend daycare. This has been an absolute nightmare. Michelle Lee looks into your troubles every day to find solutions for you. And Michelle, a lot of parents are struggling to work because they just don't have child care right now. Right. And, you know, to go along with it, it's not only a nightmare, it's a nightmare that you endure every day over and over and over again for a lot of parents. You know, child care, uh, not having child care is actually a legitimate reason to not go back to work. So here's, you know, what we know about child care if you need it. OK, there are federal dollars now being released into communities to help with child care. And most notably, most recently, Pierce County just got one hundred and fifty eight million dollars in CARES Act funds and it's spending two million solely on child care programs. So the funding will support families, hundreds of families actually, to choose a daycare for three months. There's also financial assistance for essential workers, and it will also help with relief grants to help child care providers reopen safely. Child care was already um, in crisis before COVID-19. A recent state report found that 36% of parents left their jobs entirely or school because they couldn't find quality child care. There is also a hotline that is available to Washingtonians that is for resources and referrals for child care. And if you would like to know more about the Pierce County allotment, you can text the word money to 206-448-4545 and we'll send you that information. And of course, as CARES Act dollars are going into the communities and now organizations will keep you posted if we hear of new programs being online as well. But Mimi, I know for me, I am very fortunate. I'm technically an essential worker, but I get to stay at home with my kid but even if I wanted childcare right now, my daycare isn't open. So mm -hmm. it is a very, um, it's a very frustrating and overwhelming situation for a lot of folks, and especially those who have to go outside of their homes and who might be on the brink or on the edge, you know, of a financial crisis anyway. So this is a very, very real thing for people.